If you're anything like me, you love deploying a fresh LigaML update, but you want to make sure it doesn't break an existing dashboard. Suppose there were changes to your database tables upstream, and you need to catch those changes that invalidate your LigaML. Looker Continuous Integration, or Looker CI, is designed to solve this. It's an automated safety net that catches these issues before they go to production, giving you the confidence to deploy your amazing work and get your team to data insights faster. Wait, 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 hold on, you might be saying. Continuous integration sounds like an awesome tool, Chrissy, but what is it? Well, let me break it down in just 30 seconds. At its core, continuous integration is the process of developers frequently merging their coding changes into a central repository. After each new change is submitted, an automated process kicks off to build and test the code. This allows multiple developers to integrate their code for the same LookML project simultaneously, without creating conflicts or introducing errors into the production environment. This ensures business users will ultimately get clean, validated data to analyze and explore. Now, Looker CI specifically helps you automate these tasks. It helps you find mistakes in your LookML so your code is reliable and maintainable. It's like having an extra set of eyes, reviewing every line of code before it goes live. When you set up Looker CI, you start by creating a suite, which has four validators to configure. Understanding these validators is the key piece to improving your workflow. Configure them individually to fit your needs or simply start with the default configurations. The LookML validator checks for syntax errors in your LookML. The content validator shows you which dashboards and looks will have errors if you were to deploy your code now. The SQL validator looks for incongruencies between your LookML dimensions and your database table metadata. The assert validator will run tests that you write in LookML, so data anomalies upstream can be caught and addressed. After you've created a Looker CI suite and configured these validators, you can start using the tool. You make changes to LookML, and when you create a pull request, Looker CI can automatically run a suite of validations and examine every line of your model. When Looker CI discovers something that doesn't work, it's flagged right away. You fix those issues, run CI again, and keep refining your code until every validator passes and you have polished code. With all the validations passed and the code reviewed, you can merge with confidence. Then you can deploy your changes to production, knowing they've been thoroughly tested and validated. When you have Looker CI enabled, you can build amazing things. The CI will help keep your content safe and your users happy. To add this extra layer of protection, try out continuous integration today by having an admin turn on Looker CI. I'd love to hear about how Looker CI eased your development process. Thanks for tuning in. Chat soon.